Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I am going to share with you again one thing that we do here living in Pakistan. And this is one of the most important ones. The chapati or roti as they call it. This is the step-by-step -step process on how to make chapati or roti. Here's the thing. There is no specific measurement of water that we need when we are making the dough for roti or chapati because the water will depends on what kind of flour that we are going to use. This is the reason why we have to add the water gradually. Just do the same way that we are demonstrating on how to make the dough and I can assure you that you can make a perfect dough for your roti or chapati. The dough is ready, place it on a clean box and then cover it and let it rest for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, let us start making or cooking chapati. These are the ball of dough that I made. Then using the rolling pin, let us flatten it. The frying pan or tawa hot and then place the dough. We have to turn it upside down every 30 seconds or it depends on how high is your fire. But mind you guys, you have to let the fire in the middle. Don't make it too high or too low. Just in the middle and then after that, we have to remove the tawa and cook it directly to the fire. Just make sure that all the sides are cooked just like this so if you notice they are bubbling it means it's nicely cooked and in pakistan roti and chapati is part of their meal especially during lunch and dinner time this is like a rice to them if you are a wife of a pakistani it is necessary to learn how to cook chapati or roti once you're done cooking you have to place it inside a hot pot use a clean cloth to cover it and to keep it warm then close the hot pot just like this this kind of hot pot is very common here in pakistan that's all for today and thank you so much for watching and if you are new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe like and share have a great day and see you on my next video